What up, people? Rim the Legendary. Welcome back to 80s Mania Wrestling Returns. Let's get it popping. We are here in August of 85. I need to quickly go check my login bonuses. Come on, where's my inbox? Inbox, 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 inbox. Claim. Thank you, sir. 50k. Let's have a quick look in the shop. I'm still waiting on Chance Solar's foil. Maybe one of these days. Uh, we've got a Hulk up. We've got a Mortician. Congrats. Thank you, sir. The Thinker and Trixie. So, ooh, and refreshes in three minutes. So we'll check the shop again after we've booked this month's wrestling. So, uh, let me refer to my notes. Um, yes, we've got Zen versus Flawless versus Vader for the world title picture. Okay, that makes sense given what's happened there. Let's book this up. Summer <laughs> Smash. Is Summer Smash as good as I remember it being? Uh, there's a non-title tag team. That's kind of lame. There's a singles. Triple threat for the TV title. Another singles with no title attached to it. A mixed tag. Ah, oh, that's a bit dead, you know. I used to think Summer Smash was so good, but a mixed tag. Eh. A bunch of singles. No Cruiserweight title match. Why is there not a Cruiserweight title match? This is mad. It probably means we're gonna get a cruiserweight title match within the TV shows, but still, I'm kind of annoyed. All right, let's go. Let's go book this one up. Uh, we are going to have this here can be a tag team match. Tag team match. Thank you, sir. Uh, let's do. Let's do the venue first for a change. We never do the venue first. There you go. There you go. A little bit of Canuck. Right. So I'm looking at my notes. I've started writing the notes down now because I've been finding when I'm watching my videos back that. Uh, like a booking opportunity arises and then I'm forgetting it by the time the next episode comes. So, uh, I'm just going to focus on what I've got here. So I've got Zen vs. Flawless as the number one contenders uh, match for the world title should be booked. Van Winkles and Neons. Ace vs. Mammoth is something that we're going to be booking. Dickie and Arizona for the Cruiserweight title. Uh, Linda needs a new challenger I've written down here. Jet Set Laser just for a regular feud. Uh, the All Pros vs. the Thompsons. I've got Leo and Hammer. Queen and Alphette and Slash Master versus Major Malice. Alright, so I've got a few things popping here. Triple Threat. What what could the Triple Threat be? I mean, we need people for Willy, really. So if we go to... I mean, we've got Robbins is in there somehow. Malice I'm going to do a few separate to. Death Star Boys in the Cruiserweight division. Flex. Could Flex start in the TV title division work his way up? Possibly. Or we can make this a Cruiserweight... Yeah, let's make this a cruiserweight kind of match. So we're going to book cruiserweights. And we definitely need to have Dickie in Arizona. Arizona is going to be entering the division for the first time in a while. Dickie Thunderbird is going to be in there. Good man. And then we're going to need a heel cruiserweight. So let's search by cruiserweight. We need heels. Starboy is the champ. Licks just hasn't got the push. Uh, do you know what we're going to go with Keith? Because I've given him a boost, haven't I? Yeah, so he's actually going to be a bit more competitive than normal now. Come on. Come on. Yeah, so uh started writing the notes just to make sure I'm a bit more consistent with the booking than I have been. Ladies match. I've written here we need a new contender for the title. She's beating everyone, so we're going to try and find some fresh faces. Uh, I've got Queen versus Alpha as a feud. I don't know if that needs to be a title feud straight away. So, we haven't done much with Gothica for a while. Performed a skit nine weeks ago, so let's give her a shout. And we can we can really put anyone in there. Succubus, lost to Starbright 15 weeks ago. Valley Girl has not competed in a while, so we'll run that. This is not necessarily a number one contenders match, but just a match to get these ladies on the show and start moving up the card. Mid-carders only, uh, I kind of like using... Ooh, yeah, I was gonna say Blitz, but we're gonna go Magnus. And I think we're gonna get... We're gonna get Hakatonga soon, but I don't wanna do face versus face here. I've got plenty of heels to choose from. Let's go with, uh, let's go with Tupu. Not doing much as far as his tag team's going, so let's run this, and then we could always transition into one Muscle Man versus Island Warriors. So there's that. Uh, one on one match here. Let's let's run one of these feuds I've got written down. Let's go with we can do Slash Malice, and then maybe have them main event one of those singles at the end of the uh, end of the month. 
Slash versus Major Malice. That's nice. That, that's going to build someone. Whoever wins that feud is going to come out very, very strong. Uh, we've got an Openers match. I really, I really need to start doing more with Chet because I know come the 90s, he's going to be a much bigger player on the scene. Do you know what? I'm going to Chet Thug. Let's go Chet Thug. And then a tag team match. Um, all pros versus Thompsons could be a show. All pros, Thompsons. Thompsons have just won the tag team turmoil. I say just. Like a month or two ago. These guys have had... The, the, the all pros are like just outside the top four as far as tag teams. We've got the Van Winkles up there, obviously the mutants are the champions. Looks good, start show, let's go! Let's go! All pro win here would be a massive upset, to be fair. Because Thompson's just won the tag team invitation. Our tag team division is popping, honestly. I need to put Rick. I need to put Rick and uh, Tycoon into more matches. Yeah, Thompsons have done it. They're just. It, it's kind of weird. Like the top two in this division are like so far beyond everyone else. It seems. Uh, Chet Sky versus the Thug. You, you would want a Chet win here, realistically. Yeah. Maybe. We'll get some luck pushing him in the cruiserweight division. I don't know with an eight push though. It's gonna be very hard. Slashmaster versus Malice. Ooh, that's a big win. That's a big win for Malice. Okay, we're gonna run this feud this month. Alright. I like this here. Ooh, Magnus beats it. Tupu. 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 Right, we just need someone to step up. We need a new challenger. Okay, and it's the heel, which is good. Valley Girl. Okay. And then a cruiserweight uh, triple threat. Not necessarily the more contenders, but it's going to have some sort of say on the matter. Thunderbird would be the favourite. Wow. Blood with the win. We currently have a heel champion, but we do need some more heels to step up, so... I'm not unhappy with that result whatsoever. That's nice. Uh, let's claim this. We're gonna have it. Oh, we're gonna have a TV title defense here. A major malice. I want to keep him in that feud. They are right. He probably is the number one contender, but I want to keep him in the feud. Uh, we have a number one contenders tag match, so we will go with a ladies match here. There we go. It gives us nice coverage across the board. Right, so we've just seen Valley Girl step up. Let's see if anyone else can uh, Countess. Two weeks ago was in the Battle Royal, so we're going to put her in the match. And I want to leave... I want to do Elfet versus Queen. Just as a non-title feud. We could go Tiki, I suppose. Yeah, we'll go Tiki, that's fine. Right, nothing wrong with that there. Uh, then we'll get Tenders match. So this has to be the Thompsons. They have to be one of these. And then realistically, we're talking, what, the Van Winkles, I guess? As long as there's no injuries. Is there an injury? That's the question. They're not They're not showing. I reckon, I reckon one of them's injured. Yeah, one of them's going to be injured. Uh, Neon Express or Muscle Men. Magnus just had that singles. Chet's just had that singles. Do you know what? Let's go Muscle Men. Should have been Van Winkles, but if they're injured, I don't want to spend to get them out. So let's just let's just run that one. You would expect Thompson Crew to win there. You would expect. Uh, so we got singles, a skit, a mic spot, and the TV title match. Do I really want O'Hooligan in that division? I don't know. I've got Ace written down here. This, we could run Ace. 
We've got the triple threat coming as well at the pay-per-view. So a title change here isn't that mad, because then we could throw Willie in there with someone else. One-on-one -on -one match. Um, what other feuds did I want to do? We want to do Zen and Flawless, but there's probably going to be a number one contenders match next week. So we'll leave that till then. We want to start Jet Set and Laser. I think I might have a feud for that as well. There it is. Alright, so we're going to run this. And then at the pay-per-view, we will bring the match back under stipulation. Beautiful. Right, love it. And whoever wins that will probably elevate themselves to a number one contendership. Uh, we're going to go creepy vignettes. We're going to go for our ghoulies. And we are going to do Keith. And then we're going to give him a, a cast of ghoulies as well. Put voodoo in there. I could, I could make a nice ghoulies type of uh, faction, to be honest with you. All right, just someone who gives us two pop, you'll do. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Uh, Mike Spot, I want to see a champ on this, really. Champ. Invader's Mike is dead. Starboy's dead. Oh my god, we got champs who can't speak. We got champs who cannot speak. Oh, I take this all back. I take this all back. Do you know Valedictorian? And he's, he's kind of fallen out of favour. He's had a few matches. He's not been able to pull it off. So we'll let him speak. Just stay stay in the minds of people. Of these. You just got to keep him on TV sometimes. You know what I mean? You got to keep him on TV. All right, Countess. Tiki. Uh, I'd like a Countess win, to be honest. It's not happened, but that's fine. Right, here we go. This is going to be a nice singles. And then we're going to go into a pay-per-view match. If someone goes 2-0, that might be world title contendership for them. Okay, Jet Set wins this one. If he can win the next one, that's going to throw him right back into it. Four-star match as well. Here we go. Keith Blood, talking some talk. Bit of a... Bit of a supernatural backstage thing. I'm with it. Nice four-star segment again, okay. Well, again, a victory by the muscle men would be a surprise here. Muscle men have won a tag team invitational before. So, you know, they, they have a little bit of pedigree. But you would expect Thompson Crew to win here. Thompson Crew have done it. We need to get Rick and Tycoon back. I probably should have booked them in this match, to be honest. Uh, Valedictorian, talking the talk. And then we're going to have the TV title match. Three stars. It's been a decent show. Right, Mammoth. Can you keep a hold of this? Ace is on his way. He's done it. He's done it. He's been, he's been beating jobbers. Let's be fair. He's been beating jobbers. But this... That really kind of puts a, a nice little stamp on his reign. If he can win the triple threat, that'd be crazy. It's been a while since someone's had a really good run with the title. Mammoth has five defenders, but like I said, so, some of them were eh, kind of easy. I think our, our best is six, I want to say. No, five. We've got a lot of fives, but no sixes. Jet Set was five. Warhawk was five. Mammoth is now on five. If he wins... The triple threat, he has to be our number one TV title uh, champion for a long time. Alright, this weekend, what we got? A singles, Mike Skit, and then more contenders match, and a cruiserweight title match. This here is going to be Flawless One versus Zen. They're the ones who were miles ahead of everyone else last month. Flawless, Zen. Going to be Banger. I think these two have fought that many times, if any. Uh, Death Star Boy, number one contender, Keith Blood. He is. He really is. I don't really want to do heel versus heel, but it is what it is. Sometimes you got to run it. And then a singles match. Uh, was there anything else I wanted to do? Not just yet, no. We wanted to do uh, Leo versus Hammer so we could start. Actually, yes. If we do Leo versus Hammer, and then we can do. 
a mixed tag on the pay-per-view. I don't think I even have Leo in my roster, you know. I've used him, but I don't think I was supposed to have used him. I'm gonna have to I might have to bring him in as a, a mid-season draft. Where's Leo? Or is he injured? Active or oh, it was Mighty Leo. That's what I'm looking for. Mighty. Is he in my roster or not? He is! No, no, it's just me it's me being stupid searching for Leo instead of Mighty Leo. Right, so we're gonna go Mighty. Where are you, sir? There you are. And then Hammerhead, who we haven't seen in a long, long time. There you go, we'll run that, and then we can do the mixed tag on the pay-per-view. Beautiful. Alright, method to the madness. Mike Spot. Hmm. Just see who we got near the top of the card. Vader, I can do the skit. We'll do the skit with Vader. Now let's let the dog talk. And then for the skit, uh, what is Vader? What is he? He's a Hulk. So what do we have for the Hulks? Right, give me a Hulk type skit. What do we have? What do we have here? Is it going to be a pose off type deal? Specimen that is. Hulk, here we go. So this is going to be Dark Invader, the champ. He's had the title a few times. Um, yeah, do you know, I was going to say it wasn't that good, but two defenses is not bad. It's not really that bad. Uh, I need a pop boost, so we need him. Uh, this one we have to go back to Canada, yes! Let's book all these. Let's go. Oh, damn, lots of stuff. Let's go. Okay. So, Leo and Hammerhead, kind of their first real appearances this year. They've been used sporadically. We're going to bring them into a few to see if we can do something with them going forward. Wow, Hammerhead. Mm, so not today, Leo. We're going to do, obviously, Leo and Mix, I think, in a mixed tag. And then we've got Hammerhead and Mother Russia, so that's cool. I feel sorry for Doc. I really try with him. I really try. Four-star signal, though. Invader. You know, can he grab this title and keep it for a while? If Zen wins here, I hopefully not. Zen is a four-time world champion. Ooh, and he has an opportunity to go for five, which would be the record. It would be the record. I didn't do anything there. I didn't do. I, I didn't give him the boosts. Zen did it off his own back. All right, let's go. Uh, I kind of like Death Star Boy to retain. Ooh, time limit draw. Ooh, time limit draw. Hold up, I need to write this down. So we need to we need to run Blood versus Death Star Boy for the cruiser. I need to write that down. It's done. That's done. Oh, nice, uh, nice skill boost there for Leo. Four star, four star, three star, three star, and a two. Gave us an overall of three. Our shows are getting better. The ratings are getting much more consistent. Uh, Jobber Joe and Chicano. We're not going to do that. We don't use Joe. All right, venue. I always use one of two. Depends which one I've used most recently. Right, world title match. Zen and Invader. Do we need a stipulation? If these two have feuded before, which they probably have at some point, it wouldn't have been very long, and I don't think you can bring out a stipulation for it, so we're just going to go singles. And if I give them both just a single push and skill boost, I want it to be even. There you go. Right, so just to increase the performance of the match, that's absolutely fine. Mixed tag, we already know what's going on here. We need to go Mighty Leo and Mix. Where are you two? And they're going to go up against the Russians. Tag teams. What are they going to be called? Soviet something, I imagine? Soviet Connection? 
What are you called? What are you guys called? Soviet Union. That, that makes more sense. That makes, <laughs> that makes much more sense. Right. Uh, nothing special there. I'm just going to leave it be. Nice, nice, nice. Tag team title match. It's going to be the old familiars. We can 100% have a stipulation here. 100%. For a tag team, for the two best, do you know what? Let's do it. Someone's gonna get injured, but that's fine. I'm okay with it. Ooh, and they got feud as well. Oh, oh this is gonna be a five-star banger. Oh, this is gonna be a classic. This is gonna be an absolute classic. Am I confident in the set? I am. Oh, this is gonna be a classic. Oh, I can't wait for that one. That's gonna be that's gonna be crazy. Right, that's cool. That's cool. We've got skits. We've got singles. This is gonna be Slash versus Malice. And we are going to throw a stipulation on there. Slash. Malice. And if Major Malice can win this one, then he's springboarding on to, uh, to bigger and better. Uh, we could go... We could go weapons. We could go weapons. Very nice. Here we need Jet Set and Laser. And again, we're going to give them... A special few, a special stipulation, I should say. Um, it needs to be something wrestling based, I would suggest. Iron Man, that's the one right there. Let's see if we can give them a, a simple boost each. Uh, just a skill and a push, one apiece. Do we have a one apiece? That can be one. I just need one apiece, one apiece. Give me, give me, give me one apiece. Come on, come on. There's gotta be, there's gotta be one. There's not. I don't want it to be uneven. As long as the push is one, the skill boost can be anything, but just one on the push. Oh, we'll do that. That's fine. That's fine. Jet set skills pretty high anyway. Here we need to do we need to do Rick and Tycoon. We've got to get them back in the mix. Rick, Mr. Tycoon. Let's not make a mighty mistake again. Where is he? Oh, he can't be injured, surely not. Oh maybe he's injured. How do I have so many people who's injured? Jesse, Flawless, Tycoon, Mutant. Oh my lord, Mutant's injured as well. <gasps> we could be looking at a title change. We could be looking at a title change. Title change! Right, Rick, you're out. Uh, we need... Do you know, let's go all pros. Let's just find a nice tag team to go up against. Just a, just a nice little tag team. Oh, I love Warriors. I quite like Island Warriors. It's a bit of a weird one. No heat. No heat to it at all. Uh, women's title match. Linda Harker. Oh my god, we just get to pick. We just get to pick. I was supposed to do the Queen and Elfet feud, so I need to remember that for next time. Queen versus Elfet. I mean, I suppose we could go Valley Girl here. I suppose it's Valley. That's fine. No, just a triple threat and the skits. Right, so 100% we're going Mammoth. He's beaten Ace. These guys are already pre booked. Don't really want to go Hooligan. Let's, uh, let's look at win loss ratio singles. Devin. If Devin's not injured, we'll throw him in there. Terry's another one. Ah, do you know, let's leave them in the tag team division. Let's just leave them there. Strong arm, Otto, Slammer, and Blitz. This is all tag team related uh, wins. Ace, Chet. Let's throw Chet in there. He's got a win this week. Willie's been running through a lot, a bunch of the openers. I think it makes sense to throw Chet in there. We could go Chet. We could go Chameleon. Do you know what? we're gonna go chat and chameleon. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go chat and chameleon. Cause it's part of Mammoth's gimmick gimmick is that he's been going for these like uh these openers, these easier ones to be. 
Alright, so chat, 100%. And we're gonna give him something. There you go. Nice big three push boost over that. And then we're gonna go uh, Chameleon, who is mid Carter. He has 10 on the push. We're gonna give him a little something. And you know what? We're gonna give Mammoth a little something. I just want his uh, skill up, realistically. Don't want to push, push too high or it's going to make it uneven. There's nothing I can do. He's going to be too high. We'll just leave it be then. We'll see if we can get a, a surprise title switch here. That's all good. That's all good. And then it just leaves us with skits and mic spots. Alright, let's have a look. We've done Valedictorian. We're gonna do Buzzle for the skit, I think. Infinite one up. So we could we could run Doc again. It's a bit lame. We'll go flawless. He's lost the number one contenders match. Would be nice to have him on the show still. So we'll keep him in everyone's minds, and then we're gonna go Buzzle. He's been away. Had a bad run of form. Been away. Buzzle has to be a specimen, right? to be. Uh, that's a minimum of two. Let's see if we've got a single one. There's two again. Alright, let's see if we can get two of them. A specimen, specimen, specimen. Is he, is he not a specimen? Is he a Hulk? What? Or is he a Patriot? What's going on here? What's going on here? Legendaries. Buzz. He's a Hulk. He's a Hulk. Uh. Hulk, that's gotta be the pumping iron one, right? Oh, it's right on the other end. Where are you? There you are. Buzz. I don't think there's anyone else I can use. Not realistically with a good. Ah, oh, maybe the Doc. Maybe Doc. Yeah, we'll go Doc. That wouldn't be a bad little feud, to be honest with you. Ooh, let me write this down. Doctor B versus Buzzsaw. I want to see that. Yeah, that's written down now. All right, let's fill out this merch. Yeah, more. Any more? No, 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 no. Alright, let's go! And we've got some bangers on this show, you know. This first one's a bit... It's a little bit dead. Nice to see the Island Warriors back on it, though. All pros have been decent this year. They've been solid. That's a big win for the Island Warriors. Island Warriors? Not bad, not bad, not bad. Alright, there's no way Valley's winning here, though. There's no way. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way. This has literally been all Linda for like the last year and a half. Big match here. A, a win for Jet Set and he's kind of cemented. Oh, laser! Do we run this back? Only three stars? Are you mad? Are you mad with the three stars? That's crazy. All right, flawless talking that talk. Three stars. Ah, these star ratings are low. I was expecting better. Is Mammoth gonna squash, or are we gonna have a big old upset here? I could see chat with the upset, you know. <gasps> Chameleon Kid. No. Wow, Chameleon Kid wins the TV title. Are you mad? Malice again. This guy's crazy. <laughs> Malice is on the way up. I need the right thing. Oh, here's the here's the big tag match I was waiting for. There's an injured mutant. We might have a title change on our hands there. Ooh! Thompson crew have done it! Only a three-star match? Are you crazy? What the hell? 
Nice little Hulk off between these guys. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Four star segment. Yeah, there, there's heat there. There's heat. This one kind of just framed together this month, but we'll see. A hammerhead win would probably mean that both of those faction members should start moving up their respective divisions. No! Okay. Minx. Mighty. Here we go. If Zen wins, he becomes a five-time champion. But your money's got to be on Vader here, I think. He's just won the belt. He's done it. He's done it. Woo! I thought Zen was going to be the first five-time world champion. Vader's got the title and kept it, which is... To be fair, it's good. Let, you know, let's build this champion up a little bit now. Skill boost for Blitz. Mike boost for Flawless. I can't believe that. That's crazy. Chameleon wins that one. So still, no TV champion has been able to go beyond five defenses. Malice beats Slash again. Crazy. Uh, we've got a title change here. Button injury. This feud's going to run for the year, I'm pretty sure. I like the idea of this feud. We've still got Elfet that I wanted to run as well versus Queen. So we've got a lot of feuds we can do next month. Don't know if we should call this a day or not. It's one apiece technically. And then we've got the world title match. So there we go, people. Woo! Metal, uh, just before we go, let's check that shop. See if we get our chance solar. Not there. Lasers back. No, I just want chance. Even though, let's let's be honest, that's a pretty card, right? That's a pretty card, people. Thank you very much for watching Revenant Legends. See you again, and peace.